All right, so what's your handicap? 27. Okay, it's high. Okay. <laughs> so yes. we've been on track, man. I've given Ed one lesson um, back working on the driver. He's got a lot of pull. And the main thing, interestingly enough, with the launch monitors, which he knows nothing about numbers, so we didn't talk about it, but a lot of down and left. He had the ball off. Where did you first have it? I had it? it off my front toe. Because he thought that's what people told him to do. Correct. That helped him swing more left, more down. So that wasn't good. So we moved the ball back. But the main thing we did, I think, mm -hmm. is just to help you swing the club. Right. And so what might help everybody hold the club? How tight were you holding it? I was holding it on your scale like eight or nine. Okay, eight or nine plus the face was shut. Correct. So I just came in here, did some few little circles. We're trying to feel a grip pressure scale of four in each hand. Right. You were afraid the club's going to go flying. Right. Okay, it's not. And then here, let go. Uh -huh. I held it and just showed you if I was going to play on the first tee mm -hmm. with my buddies that I could move the club. Right. Okay. So you set up there. We also did some orange whip, some rope swings, just to get a nice swinging feel. And mainly, what's our main swing thought, aside from setup? Light grip and more athletic. Yeah, more athletic. So Ed is an athlete. <laughs> Thank you. So we're trying to be more athletic. So now I'm gonna tee it up just a little bit higher. And we're just going to rip it, but mainly it's just, it, this is the easiest part, but as soon as the grip pressure got lighter, all these numbers on this launch monitor got better. Okay, go for it, man. You nailed it. I know. <laughs> oh my God.